cheek. Please don't give me hype. Right cheek, right cheek. Write my name in ice. ice. Real ass, real ass, real ass, real ass. Got this shit from Tina. I'm a Hey y'all, I'm back with another tech video. I hope y'all are enjoying these and I hope this is helping you out. So if you edit in iMovie, you know that iMovie does not have plug-ins. And even if you don't, sometimes you may want to use a green screen or have an overlay on your video. So I create my own green screens using Canva. You can find some on YouTube, but sometimes it's just easier to create your own. This video is gonna be short and sweet. It's so simple, like literally, you open up the YouTube thumbnail template and you turn the background green and then you can put any image in there and it will overlay on top so I have this image of Jayla with her money gun so I'm going to use that with the falling money and I could have put this in my YouTube hustle video um, you can also create a subscribe green screen I've seen those a lot on YouTube. So, you know, throughout the video, you can have this pop up. You know, when you put it into iMovie, you can add sound effects. And here on Canva, you can actually add animation, which I'm doing here, depending on how you want it to pop up. And you can also change how long you want it. As you can see at the top, there's a clock and you can change the duration of it. Also, I'm sure that you've seen many YouTubers like put their social media handles with the logos of the social media. Like this is super easy y'all, literally. So <laughs> I've had a few videos before this about Canva to go into a little more specifics and details, but it's literally just clicking and adding. So to add the social media logos, you just go to elements, you can type in the social media logo that you want to find. And then to add the text, you just click on the word text, type in your font, you can change your font, you can change the size, the color, you can add effects. So this is me just playing around, moving stuff around. Super easy, super simple. I promise you this is full proof. And you know, I just like using green screen sometimes. You could also use things with transparent backgrounds. But a lot of times with videos, if you wanna have things moving in and out, you have to have a green screen or plugins if you're using something like Final Cut Pro or Adobe Premiere Pro. And the, the cute thing that Canva has is these little stickers. So they're already animated and they're moving. So that's another element that you can add to your video. So it doesn't just have to be for social media promotion. It can be for like something that you said or you know, just a cute little funny um, animation. They have this one that says comment below. You know, a lot of times you're talking in your YouTube video and you want your audience to have feedback and you want to include them in the conversation. So you can have that to pop up on the screen to remind them to comment below. And you see they have these animated arrows. So I just played around with this just to show you all what can be done with green screens in Canva. And then my next video is going to show you all how I edit my videos in iMovie and I'm also going to be showing you all how to actually implement and use these green screens in your video editing process. I'm gonna play the green screens here so you can just see what they look like and see how they'll animate on your actual video. So when you put this on top of your video in iMovie, you will not see the green background. You're just gonna see the images or the little stickers that you have placed there. So if you all have any questions whatsoever, please drop a comment down below. I'm going to respond. I'm going to help as much as I can and explain as much as I can to help you out. Remember, this is all trial and error. I didn't know all this stuff beforehand. It's all a learning process. So try it, make mistakes, learn from the mistakes and see what happens. And don't take yourself too seriously. It's all about learning. So I hope this all helped you out and I hope you all are enjoying my tech videos and I'll be sure to see you in the next one. Bye. No comparison.